Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, I'm hoping to be back here for the month of December and I won't do any introductions or explain why I've been away for so long because I feel like I'm always complaining. So <laughs> without any further ado, let's begin this video. Having feelings isn't a sign of weakness. Feelings mean we are human. As a person that used to suffer from social anxiety, and I actually still do a little bit, I can tell you that many people would never have thought that I struggled so much because I used to hide it quite well. And I can tell you for a fact that plenty of people, even those closest to you, struggle on the inside, but because so many of us decide to bottle it up, it might seem that everyone's fine. Everyone but us. And then we end up feeling alone in all of this. And neither depression nor anxiety are a sign of weakness. Think of people with high functioning versions of those disorders. Now, they get whatever, wherever they want in life. They work hard every day. And they even help others along the way. Now, would you call that person weak? Of course not. I think the first step here is admitting to yourself that something's not quite right and getting help. Just call it by its name. There's this horrible misconception going around and it makes me want to scream whenever I hear someone say depression equals entitlement compared to the starving kids in Africa, you're so privileged, get a grip, get over it and just get back to work. And I know that you might feel shame for not being your best self when you think about your circumstances. And you might come to the conclusion that you should be perfectly happy compared to others. But consider this. I think that telling someone that they can't be depressed because they are, um, I don't know, rich, they have everything in life, they have a loving family... Or, for that matter, telling someone that they can't have social anxiety because they are pretty and a girl. I've heard that so many times. All of this is just as ridiculous as saying that celebrities are immune to cancer. These things are not a choice. No one is exempt. Now, I know it's tempting to just hold your head up, just keep smiling and never tell anyone. But through speaking about your own struggles... You might end up saving a life. Yours and someone else's. Now imagine this. Both you and someone that's very close to you struggle with depression, but neither of you say anything, ever. It gets so bad to the point where your friend decides to take their own life. Now, it could have been avoided. I, of course, don't want to blame anyone or put any pressure on you. Or anyone else. But imagine more people came out to each other. Yeah, sure, just talking about it won't cure you. But the more people talk, the less stigma there is. And the more likely it is that they won't be afraid to reach out for help before it's too late. So many tragedies prevented. Now, the cause of mental health issues is not always, but very often, caused by a genetic predisposition or a chemical imbalance in the brain, so you can't just say that it's a choice and shake it off. The majority of people struggling with depression will improve through therapy and or medication. So why stay silent? Why struggle alone? Life isn't always perfect, but it can have its beautiful moments. And I know that if you're struggling right now, it might seem like you'll never be able to experience those moments ever again. But trust me, you can get there. If therapy seems like a step too much for you at this point in time, just try talking to someone first. Now, if your parents and friends ignore you, and that happens way too often, sadly, even venting on Reddit really might be helpful. And you are more than welcome to talk about it here in the comment section below this video. I think that community, um, my channel's community is incredibly, incredibly supportive. So trust me, there are people out there that want to listen. 
So that's it for the day guys, thanks for watching, I hope to see you soon or actually get heard soon because this will probably be the way I am going to be uploading in the next few days or few weeks. Um, I'll try to upload daily actually, but let's see what happens. Anyway, thanks for listening and I shall speak to you soon again. Bye bye!